<laughs> Cheeky madam. Wanted to give me every reason why I shouldn't be boxing and also tell me just how dangerous it is. Really? Or was you just avoiding having this? Ben, you've had a shock. I get that. Your head's all over the place at the moment, but you always do this. You clam up, you go inside yourself, and then you explode when it gets too much. What else am I supposed to do? Talk to me. I don't want to put any of this on you. But, but Ben, I'm, I'm still carrying it. I just don't know what it is. I guess... I'm not really coping. OK. OK, OK, see? That wasn't that hard, was it? Is it, is it, is it the stuff with Lola, Lewis? Everything. Or... Everything. Yeah. <laughs> I better get that. Yeah. Hello? Uh, yeah, yeah, all right, yeah, come on. Huh. It's Jay and Lola. What's she forgotten? Nothing. I, um, just want to talk to you about something. Don't worry, it's nothing bad. Sit down. Um, we've been thinking about Lexi's future. Yeah. And I was thinking that I want Jay to adopt Lexi. What? I just want to make sure that she's okay. You know, after I've died, I just want to make sure everything's yeah, but she's, she's already got a dad, me. We know that. And that doesn't change, Ben. It doesn't. It doesn't. I just want to make sure Jay's got a proper role in Lexi's life for when I've died. That's all. Does he need to adopt her? No, place, right? no, of course he doesn't. Ben. You do not get to make decisions on my daughter's life without me just because you are dying. No, no, no this is not coming to talk to you. Come on, mate. Don't mate me! All right, don't mate me! You think you're going to take my little girl away from me? You've got another thing coming in. If, if you try, I swear you will have a big fight on your hands. 